back to my channel. I know it's been a long time. I'm honestly, the video that will you guys will see before this video was filmed like early December. You guys aren't gonna see it until early January. The same with this video. I kind of was just like, let's film now. And then when 2021 starts, we'll come with a full on thing. Sorry, I have to turn my air down because you'll always end up hearing my air when I'm in the car. And I'm always in the car. Um, Today, you're just gonna be running errands with, errands with me. I have to go to Target to return Cards Against Humanities because basically I bought the game um, on like two weeks ago and then I went to Christmas Eve party and we were doing like I think it's like white elephant where everyone just picks a number you know you get to steal or take gifts but then I ended up getting Cards Against Humanities so I was like ooh let me take that Cards Against Humanities and then I can just um, go return the one I bought so then I get $25 back so I'm gonna do that I have to pick up my prescription at the pharmacy there too and then after that, we are going to go to the mall. I need to buy, I need to return an outfit from Forever 21 that I bought that just kind of didn't look right. Um, and then I may be shopping for some Uggs and I may be shopping for a wallet to match my purse. I'll show you guys my purse a little bit later. Um, but it kind of depends. I might do one or the other. I don't think I'm gonna do both unless there's like a really good deal, which I doubt it. Cause you know, but we'll see. Other than that, that's pretty much the intro for this video. So I will see you guys when I get to Target. You guys are probably gonna be able to hear the air, but a girl is hot. Um, you should see my purse. This was my purse, and I was trying to find a wallet to match this purse. They only have white, and white gets dirty. And they didn't have. They only have this color in like a really small wallet. I didn't want it to get like lost in there. Wow, I just hit myself in the face. So I ended up not getting one. Um, I did go to Target. I did my return. And then I went to the mall. And I had a proper 21 return. But um, I'll tell you guys about that later. But I got two games from Go Games. I think it's like Go Games is the place. So this one is Color Me Drunk. And so basically there's six um, ties, like bracelets things, like you know the elastic bracelets, and then there's six um, dice. So basically you're going to roll all six dice. So say three yellows were rolled, two reds, and one blue. Then the person with the yellow bracelet would have to take three shots, and the person with the red bracelet would have to take two shots. And the person with the blue bracelet would have to take one and so on and so on. So you just keep rolling and basically color me up. Um, so I think this will be a really fun game to play like when I'm back at school. Um, but yeah, and they were having like a deal. Like the whole store was like 50% off. So I thought this was like, it's originally $14.99, but I got it for $7. So I thought this was really cool and really fun to play. And the next thing I got was like, um, was Never Have I Ever. My home, never have I ever. Um, everyone has played Never Have I Ever before, but this one is just kind of like a board game version. So basically, like this is the board game, and you start here, and you want to wait. Yeah, you start here, and you want to end the other side. So there's like dots for every color: so purple and purple, blue and blue, yellow and yellow, orange and orange. And so then you just read off the thing, and each card has um, three Never Have I Ever's basically if you have you take a shot if you haven't um you get to move forward a space and so normally it's like kind of with your hand so you but instead of if you haven't done it then you get to move forward instead of putting the finger down but this was really fun it comes with one six-sided dice so that person is the one who like chooses the question one board game, 358 questions, 82 activities, and eight pawns. And like the rules are inside. So I thought this would be fun again to play when I'm back at school. I have like Cards Against Humanity, um, Black Card Revoked. We have Girl, the Girl Rules game. I think that's what that's called. Um, we have a lot of stuff, like a lot of already games, but we don't have a games that are like, we play drunk, you know, a lot. But this is like a good game to play too. And then I did my return at Forever 21, but then they were having a 50% off sale 
for all their outerwear and sweaters and so this was originally $27.99 I got it for $14.99 and basically it's just this like nice warm cozy sweater that I think um once I head back to class you know and it's kind of like chilly out some leggings and this will just go perfect with like some Uggs or some tennis shoes or something so I got this because I was just like I want a sweater and it was really cute now I'm drinking my Taco Bell drinking my Taco Bell and drinking my Pepsi that I got from Taco Bell I really want these Uggs but I think it just makes more sense to go to the Ugg store to buy them and that's at North Park and your girl is just really not feeling about driving all the way downtown to go to North Park so I'm just trying to think of like what else I needed to do I need to go to Hobby Lobby to return some things but I have to take my dog to the groomers on Wednesday and that's kind of like right next to each other so I don't really know. I could go to Walmart uh, for Christmas. I got my purse that I showed you guys. I got some cash, which is really all I care about. And um, oh, my charm bracelet. I don't know if I've talked to you guys since we did. We started our charm bracelets with my best friend, Michaela. She was in my best friend tag video, and if you haven't seen that, I'll link it down below. Um, basically, we got our charm. So I have a snowflake on my charm because she has a winter birthday, and then she has a sun on her charm because I have a summer birthday and then the next charm is this best friend charm so it's half of a heart she has the other half of the heart obviously and then on this one it's my school color so prairie view is purple and gold and then she goes to texas women's university so her colors are maroon and white so she has those and so basically for christmas for christmas for birthdays this was just something we decided to do because it was a lot easier and just fill it up so I got that for Christmas and honestly I had a really fun Christmas. I hung out with my other best friend, his name is Craig, which you guys will see him in the video that was uploaded before this one. So if you haven't seen that video, that video will be linked down below too. That was us getting ready for Michaela's birthday. Um, I feel like I'm talking really fast, but I'm really not trying to. But basically, I think that's it. I can just let you guys know what's coming up because 2021 I'm really gonna try to stay focused on YouTubing um I think a lot of stuff just happening last time I talked to you guys I was working at pink and then I quit pink in July early August and I started working at Claire's and I was working at Claire's up until October and then I quit Claire's I was an assistant manager at Claire's and then I left Claire's to be a teacher's assistant at Uplift Education, and I love that job, that's the job I'm at now. Obviously, that works better for me because I'm going to school for education, so basically, it just helps me with get my foot in the door. Um, next semester, I'm having to go back onto campus, so you guys will see a lot of fun videos with that, too. I think I have a few videos lined up. One of my friends wants to do my makeup, so that will be on her channel, but then on my channel, we will do something, too, so kind of like a collab um and then i have another friend who has a youtube channel um and my friend Jalen. we are actually roommates so i'm pretty sure you guys will see a lot of content between the two of us and just trying funny things it will only be us two and so i think that's a lot that's gonna come up other videos i don't really know i mean though i know a video that's coming up for sure and late January, early February will be me moving back on campus, so packing up the car, packing up my room, driving out there, and um, unpacking and, you know, decorating my room. So I don't know if I'm going to do those in three separate vlogs, because normally you guys would do this. You guys kind of get these videos in August, but since I didn't move on campus, they're going to be now. So I don't know if it's going to be like a pack with me, and then a drive with me, and then unpack with me so I really don't know my I think it'll just determine on how much I film but I'll start filming I'll start getting ready to film that video pretty soon though actually so I guess it just depends on how much footage I get for each little section will determine um how many videos it is other than that you guys help me if you guys want to see any videos of me and just kind of starting because I really want to stick to YouTube and I really just want to get 
the goal for the goal to get is a hundred subscribers before July. We're at 30 and honestly, I'm not very um, consistent with uploading so I completely understand why we don't have a lot of subscribers. But the goal is to get to 100 subscribers before the end of July. I think I said January earlier, but I really meant July. Um, so fingers crossed we get that and I really hope we do. And I think it's just happy to set these really like good goals for us. So 100 by July, 50 by May. So we only need 20 more subscribers to get to 50. I really hope you guys are gonna enjoy my videos. If you're not, comment down below what I need to do better. I've heard that I need to get more excited, so I'm really trying to do that too. But it was nice talking to you guys, babe. See you soon.